Hey guys, Tom Ball 719 here. Today we're going to be checking out more robot warfare. Now, yeah. Now, um, I've been playing the game a little bit. I don't play the game as much as I do war robots. Let me see what it is. But let's go to the whole point and see. Now, there's a couple features that I didn't cover in my first video. First off, I was wrong about you couldn't spawn again. I just didn't have any more pilots. So you have to buy pilots with gold to um, you have to spawn in with more bots. So yeah. So yeah. So yeah, um... Oh, there's also first person, so that's one thing I forgot to mention in my first video. Which, which is something, and I'll agree, war robots need, need, well, not necessarily needs, but would be nice to have. And, and my team can't enforce anything if it was save, saved with the game. Save their lives. Enforce anything. Oh, and if you see me having customized classes, don't, don't, when you, if you download this game and you start playing, don't, don't change the classes, they're just fine with the way they are. You get away from me. You can also buy drones in this game. There's a lot, lot of content in this game. And this is like, this is like the Kimiho from War Robots. And this is also a relatively new game. So yeah. This is my favorite right here. Oh yeah. So yeah, three kills, two deaths. So yeah. 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 And yeah. This game you can buy. You can get stuff just from leveling up. Like I'm about to get this guy. And this guy. So yeah. Let's jump into another round. Bots may or may not talk during this. So yeah, so yeah. Start being really quiet. But, yeah. 
so if you Things don't really do much. Nobody's been taking any beacons, which I can't blame them. The only problem I have with this game is that you. The only problem I have with this game is the fact that it's just like so, so like looks so looks so much less. Less looks so weird compared. When you compare this to War Robots, you can you would think this would you would think this would be a worse copy of War Robots, but it's actually a pretty decent copy, as far as I've seen. Cause that that's where a lot of companies that try trying to make games off of, based off of other games do. They have a problem when they um I keep walking off when they um try they're trying to um. Make it like almost perfectly looking, perfect looking. You you look at it and say, "Wow, they failed really badly." So yeah. Oh, and there's also no names in this game. There's no names in this game, so. Leveling system is much more, much more efficient than World Robots. I'll give them that. So noobs can fight with noobs, and pros can fight with pros, and not just everybody fighting in one arena, which is, which is kind of what World Robots have been doing with the Champion League, with the leagues. Like you unlock one, you unlock one league, and as you progress and get better and better, you unlock more leagues. So that's kind of. It's kind of sort of what they're trying to do here. They try to do in War Robots, but it wasn't as effective as completely just scrapping that idea and then just making it. If you have really amazing bots, you play with the really amazing people. And I can see a lot of people disagreeing with that because it's actually a really unfair way. To travel, so if you're just paying money, pouring money into the game, you're just going to get absolute. If you're pouring money into World Robots and you don't know how to play, you're just gonna absolutely get wiped out. So that's or in this game. So that that'll be about the end of the video. Video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe and subscribe and. Click that notification button. And, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.